Dear Evernote, we've been together for years. It's been great. You've done an amazing job of organizing all my notes. I respect you, but I want to break up. And in case you're wondering, it's not me, it's you. The thing is, I bought this expensive iPad Pro and Apple Pencil. I want to get my money's worth, and I love using them. But while Evernote supports both, Microsoft OneNote takes that support further. Let me give you an example. I take lots of pictures of slides during conference sessions. I like organizing the best ones into a single note and then using my Apple Pencil to annotate those slides. Evernote and OneNote both let me do that, but here's the thing. OneNote lets me use my Apple Pencil to draw not just inside an image, but around it too. OneNote just gives me a lot more freedom to handwrite notes wherever I want. Okay, so let me give you another example. I like to type conference notes into a Word file on my iPad Pro. OneNote's integration with other Microsoft iPad apps lets me easily embed that Word document into the same OneNote file that has all my conference slides. I can then use my Apple Pencil to mark up the Word document. Evernote on the iPad doesn't let me embed a Word file in a note. I can do that on my desktop with Evernote, but come on, where's the fun in that? Evernote just raised its prices and added some new restrictions to its free service. OneNote is free, and OneNote recently added an Evernote import tool, so it's now super easy to switch. Evernote, you're still an awesome app. You really are. And you do some things better than OneNote, like clipping web content, but you just don't care enough about my iPad Pro and Apple Pencil. So until you do, all I can say is...